Good afternoon, everyone. It's a beautiful Tuesday here in Vancouver. Hope you're doing well, that you can hear me well. Just came off a 15-minute uh, webinar uh, that I listened to, and I just made a few notes here to share with you because when it hits me right here, I know it's going to make um, for some good stuff for you to marinate in your mind as entrepreneurs out there. I'm always documenting my journey, and so I'm always trying to be raw and real and humble and sincere in sharing with you what's in my head, what I'm thinking about. And what he spoke about is what super uber successful people use. And you know what they use? They use leverage. They have leverage in their time and they're always going after leverage. And he really spoke to something about being busy. And boy, did that speak to me when he spoke about busy equals laziness. Okay, busy equals weakness. Busy equals fear. Being busy equals out of control. And I get caught up in all the distractions in my life, like I know a lot of you out there, where at the end of the day, what got done? Perhaps a lot of things that weren't the priority in your life. And so when he hit me with that, that my busyness often is just laziness of the mind, distractions, Facebook, um, you know, checking that website, uh, watching TV too often or too long, you know, busy equals that weakness, being fearful, you know, being out of control. Everyone is busy. In my business of network marketing, when I'm calling out to people and everyone says, ah, don't want to chat with you, I'm too busy. Is that busyness getting you where you want to get to? And that is the key. Is that busyness that you're sharing with to the world, where is that getting you? He spoke about not all activities. Hey, Jillian, I hope you're doing well. Not all activities are equal. You know, they talk about super uber successful people and I'm wanting to be a super uber successful person like I know Jillian is and many other leaders on our team. The super uber successful person doesn't get everything done every single day. They don't get everything done every single day they shared with us today. They get the most important things done every single day. Okay, and that made me really reflect when I'm busy and I hear people saying they're busy. We're all busy and we're going to continue to get busier in this world of distractions. But the super uber people get not everything done every single day and come up with I'm just busy and everyone's busy as if I'm supposed to feel good because you're busy. Did you get the top one or two or three priorities done in your day to end the day successfully? And that you feel really good about where you're going in your business and open, you know, and able to open up the next day and feel even better the next day as a result of what happened today. It has nothing to do with your talent, with your upbringing or your race or whatever else, etc. as they say. It's how are you allocating your time and effort and focus. So I thought that was really powerful because it really hit home with me that in a world, especially in our business, we're speaking to people that are busy. What are you busy? You're just busy running around. And as a result of being busyness, often, Marco, and I always speak in first person, it's a sign he mentioned in this webinar of being basically lazy, you know, weak, poor, fear, just out of control. So let's try to remove busyness out of our lives. I speak to myself and to whoever is feeling the same thing and use leverage. And that's where what I'm doing with many other successful leaders in our organization, creating leverage in our lives. Because as I'm learning that if you are truly the focal point of your income every single day, whatever you're doing, again, I'll repeat that. If you are the focal point eight hours a day, 10 hours a day to earn your income every single day, you're in trouble. And that's where I'm learning to create with this business vehicle, leverage, leverage my time and effort so that I am focused every day on the important task to create ongoing greater leverage in my life for the love of my family and not just be busy. Okay, so I hope I brought some value to you on what super uber successful people use 
and that is leverage. And I'm hoping to get there one day like a lot of other of my growing business partners. If you like, share, comment below, and we will catch up with you on the flip side tomorrow. Bye-bye. Ciao.